You missed the cutscene, but she got pissed off, flipped out, because she found out she was being used, and they lied to her. So she just jumped out the fucking airplane, and Aiden carried her to a city. Let's see what happens. Don't fuck with Jody. Alright. Didn't kiss Ryan. Yeah, I knew he was a fuckboy. Avoided capture. Yeah, because I'm a fucking boss. Took weapon soldiers. No other choice. Rescued on the roof. Spotted in town, so there's a path where I wasn't supposed to get spotted. I wonder how that would have played out. Maybe the kid wouldn't hit me. Spotted at the checkpoint. <clears throat> didn't attempt suicide. What? Yeah, I didn't. Fuck that. It's coward's way out. Oh shit. He doesn't Jody, know it. My little princess. Oh let me look at you, girl. Oh my god, what a beautiful young woman you've become. Just as pretty as ever. A little sad and lost. Like the first time I saw you. You can't even imagine how much I missed you. How's Aiden? Oh, yeah. Uh, good to see you too, buddy. <laughs> oh, yeah. <sighs> I was worried. They're looking for you. I had to run away. I mean, I had no choice. Have they made any progress on the infra world? Oh, they've sunk millions into developing a new condenser. The most powerful ever created. Of course, that was only possible once the army got involved. And you? What are you working on? I'm running a small group. We're trying to classify types of entities, see if they're different species, that kind of thing. It's not the highest priority, but I get to do what I want. So. Cool. You're working with the army? Oh, Nathan had no choice, really. It's funding on the condition of exploring possible military applications. <laughs> Go figure. What I talked to you about? Did you find out anything? <clears throat> On the day you were born, a woman named Nora Gray had a child in the DPA hospital. Her child was declared stillborn. Where is Nora now? 
She was interned in a psychiatric oh, hospital just after she gave birth. According to her file, she should still be there now. Illuminati. My mother's locked up in a mental hospital. I'm sorry, Jody. I've got to go see her. Jody, I know how you feel, but <coughs> she's in a mental hospital. You might not get the answers you're looking for. I'm not looking for answers. I just need to see her. I mean, don't you understand? She's my mother. If I could look her in the eye, I could find out who I truly am. Jody. She's in a high security DPA facility, and you're wanted by every law enforcement agency in the country. You won't be able to walk right in. Nothing's gonna stop me from seeing her. Damn. Hey. What did you say, nigga? No, I'm kidding. You didn't think I was gonna let you go alone, did you? Oh. Hey, for once, I don't have to possess the dude. He's gonna help me out. I don't like it, Judy. No guard on gate. Empty parking lot. Something doesn't feel right. Just stay here. Not back in 30 minutes. Just go. Girl, I didn't come here to wait in no car. Cole, Cole, wait. If he dies and it's on my hands, I'm gonna fucking feel like a piece of shit. Fuck. Come on, can you run? It's in the fucking rain. Elevators have fucking anti. Wait, no. Eight meters. God, you're weak. Try the polite approach. Gets them every time. Alright. Hey, um, I've come to see Nora Gray. Can I see your authorization? I knew I forgot something. <laughs> I'm sorry. All visitors must have the correct authorization. And I fucked up. So. Hey, we don't know what room she's in. I'll find out. Nora Gray, seventh floor, room forty-three. So far, so good. Yeah. Okay. You gotta distract the guard first. Don't play it like that. Oh, this dude's a 
fucking Christian, so around. I can't possess him. I can see you, Aiden. <laughs> what? I can see you. <laughs> oh, fuck, this dude's possessed. Ah, oh, shit. Move down, move down, move down, move down, move down, move down. Fuck. Wake the fuck up. Open the fucking door. And while you're at it, go jump off the ledge. <laughs> Just made that up. Didn't think you would actually do it. Fucking kidding me. Something's gonna happen. Oh my god. Fucking hit the fucking card. Ah, uh, Jesus. Crazy folk really freaked me out. Can we find room 43 and get the hell out of here?
come on, come on. Let's find your mom and get the fuck out of here. Kind of like Terminator 2. Oh shit. Good job. Jody, I'm here. Trying to set me up, uh. I wait here. Jody, she may have lost her mind. She might not even know you're there. You shouldn't go in. <clears throat> That's my mom. I'll make her see. Take care of everything. It's for the best. You know that. She may develop yeah. some special abilities. Let us know as soon as anything unusual happens. Increase the dose. Make sure she never regains consciousness. That's fucked up. I love you. 
more than anything else in the world. Nothing will ever change that. I didn't even know he could do that. I just thought about it in my head. Am I that dark? I can't go there. Okay. but let's see what the fuck is going on here no 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 not that way I'm gonna have to remember that for some reason. I don't know why. Look at all you fucking CIA idiots. I 
most powerful condenser ever created. Impressive, isn't it? Nathan! Oh! Oh, oh shit. Good to see you. I was so afraid something happened to you. You've lost weight. You look exhausted. But at least you're alive. Let's go into my office. Please, have a seat. How do you feel? <laughs> um, I've been better. That hit on the head did not help. Oh, I'm sorry. I told them not to hurt you. I just didn't want to give you a chance to use item. What happened to my mother, Nathan? Right to the point. Nora yeah. was unstable. They were afraid she was a danger to herself and her baby. My mother would never hurt me. They couldn't take that chance. Look, I was a researcher at the DPA. Jelly. And I use Iden. I didn't discover until much later what happened. Where's Cole? He's at home. He's fine. I know he was trying to help you. Don't worry, there won't be any consequences for last night. Why all the lies, Nathan? Those people pretending to be my parents. The DPA thought you needed a stable emotional environment. A home, loving parents, some semblance of a normal life. Whatever would help us study you in the right conditions. Study me? Study me? What was I to you, Nathan? A little lab rat? I was just a girl, for fuck's sakes. I was just a little girl. Oh, you were the link. The link between our world and the infra world. You were everything we ever dreamed of. Wow. Thanks. Fuck off. So now what? You're just gonna hand me back to the CIA? Is that the plan, Nathan? They brought you here because they have something for you to do, and they'd be very grateful if you do it. I wouldn't. I already... You're asking me to help the people who wanted to kill me? Is that what you're asking me, Nathan? Listen, Jody... Why should I listen to you? You work for them, and you lied to me about my mother and my parents, and for what? The money, or the power, or the fame? Oh, stop that, Jody. You know that's not true. I know nothing anymore. We know another country has discovered the infra-world. They think it's something to be controlled or manipulated. They have no idea what they're dealing with. How do I if know? entities this enter is our the world, church. do you know what that would mean, Jody? I've already experienced it. What has all this got to do with me? Because you know the infra-world better than anyone. It's the CIA's job. And I'm done with that. They want to offer you a deal. You do this for them. And they let you out, you're free. Jody, do you know what would happen if a passage is open? It'll be the apocalypse. You have the power to stop this. According to our intel, the Republic of Kazakhstan has discovered the existence of the Infoworld. Found a rift, conducting experiments from a secret base located in the province of Hainanjiang. We don't know what stage they are in their experiments, but we've detected important fluctuations within the Infoworld. That means they found a way to interact with the other side. Now your mission, 
is to destroy this condenser. Any other advanced technology you find. Even if we manage to destroy the condenser, the rift will still be there. Uh, building a condenser is a costly and time-consuming business. But this operation will gain time to better understand the human world and to make sure that no one will try to use it against us. I assume the site will be heavily guarded? Well, you should expect considerable military resistance. Team will. Team? Show them in, Marla. Hey, baby. Good to see you, girl. Clayton's team goes with you, a small, agile commando unit able to avoid detection. All right. Mission begins in two days. Hate to pause it there. Time.